Hey everyone, it's Jenny. I'm back with another project share. So I am, this is a new setup for me. So we'll see how this um, works out, if it works out better. Um, I may also relocate my new stand um, to like over here instead. <laughs> so we, we're, we're just trying it out. But anyway, I just wanted to um, share with you this project that I just finished up um, putting, making things to put inside. And this is for my two um, crafty friends who are here in Hilo. And I really wanted to make this um, little caddy that um, that Christian had come up with. It's the mini version of the Nicole Silhouette one. And Nicole's one is only available on um, her Silhouette store on Etsy. But, and I bought it, but I'm like, I can't. me and machines don't get along. So... Um, when Christian came up with like a manual version, I'm like, okay, I'm going to try it. And it was actually really easy once I watched the whole video. And I was like, oh my god, I can totally do that. So I made two in one night. Um, but what's taken me so long is just making the stuff to put inside. So anyway, I just thought I would like share with you what I came up with. So mainly, I think I just used the Doodlebug Hippity Hoppity collection because I wanted to try and use some of that um, this season before I have to put it away. Um... And I tried to use some of the ephemera and whatever came with the kits. So I did purchase mine from Frank Garcia's studio, but um, Tara also has some on Urban Gems if you want to stock up for next year because Easter's tomorrow already. But anyway, so this is the craft caddy. Um, so now you're looking down on my stuff instead of like this way. Um, so let me just show you what I put on. I used um, my old Flatback Pearls as feet. I just got in the wheels, um, but it was too late. I had already put the feet in. And then here is um, more ephemera. And then I put some of my flowers back here. And then the front, I just used the little bunnies on the scooter. And then um, I did try to use my magnets and it's just, it's really, really small. So it's not very effective. Um, it's okay, but it's not really strong. Um, so on this one, I changed it a little bit. Let me just show you what's inside. So I did put, I did finish making a po some pokey tools for them. And I added on a bunny because it's for Easter. But my friend likes more like peach colors and rose gold so I made her this one and then I made her this um pen because I did get the pen blanks but I was having such a hard time finding um beads that fit through the hole and I was trying to use my new bead reamer but it was giving me my it was making my hands sore so I decided to stop anyway so this one I used the new Hello Kitty um bead as you can see here and then I put the hearts along with some rondelles, and then I just added some more peach and um, orangey um, charms. So that's that. And then then I came up with, um, well, I had already made these, and I shared this in a previous video, but I'm going to give them some uh, sentiments and butterflies. Um, I had a few extra packs of these um, sequence mixes, and then these are the flowers that I made. These are using that Sizzix dye, which I really love. I think I'm going to make more of that. So that's what will be in their little caddy. Um, so let me show you the other one that I need. I'm going to wrap that a little bit nicer, but I just wanted to, I didn't wrap it because I'm going to show it to you now. Okay, so this one I modified it a little because my magnets weren't working and I didn't have my new magnets yet. So I just put a strip here um, and then I added in a strip here to make it like a little slot. And I think this is kind of what Kayla did for her messenger bag, if you haven't already watched her video. Um, so I, I thought that maybe I'll just use one and stick it in here. And I, I kind of like that how that came out better for this project. And then I decorated the sides and the back I put one of the another ephemera. I really love this little bug. Um, Paper. It's so cute. Okay, and then she gets the same thing as the other girl. And then um, let me just show you the pokey tools because they're those are a little different. So this one I went with more shabby colors. Um, and she can take off the bunny if she doesn't want it to be like Easter-ish. But I think it came out really cute. And then this one I used purple, and then I made it 
I used the stars in it instead because um, those beads fit nicely and then I just added a bunch of other dangles okay so that is my project share my Easter project share for um, this year and I hope they like it I'm gonna try and see when I can drop it off to them but otherwise I um, hope you guys have a great Easter and I will talk to you guys in the next video bye